Hello everyone, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. Today we are going to solve the problem of the day that is create complete binary tree from linked list. My name is Saurabh Bansar. I'm a mentor at Geeks for Geeks. So let's start the video and let's firstly understand the question and then we will find the approach and then we will solve the question. Okay, so we are on computer screens. So what they have given to us? So they have given us a linked list. Now we have to convert this linked list into a complete binary tree. Now the question arises, arises, what is complete binary tree? So complete binary tree, a complete binary tree is a binary tree where every level is completely filled. Every level of this tree is completely filled. Expect the last, okay. Expect the last, except the last level, every, uh, every level is completely filled and the last level will be filled from left to right, okay. So this is the definition of complete binary tree. Now let's try to see the approach of this question now they have given us a linked list and the, we have to create a complete binary tree from this so we will take use of a queue okay so i'm making a queue over here let's say this is queue okay firstly what we have to do is i will take this node and make it as a rule so first node is going to be the root node and the subsequent the next two nodes will be will, uh, are going to be the child nodes okay so i will make this two as the left child and three as the right child okay now what i will do is now i will make this four as the left child of this two and five as the right child of two now let's try to find out how we will do this in the code okay so firstly i will tell you the approach then we will discuss it okay so this is the thing we have to do how to do that okay so firstly i will make one root node over here like this then what I will do is I will push this into the queue and also when I have made this thing now I will move the head to the next node. okay now what will what I will do is if the head is not null then I will take this one one from the queue so I will take this one from queue and put the two as the left child and then I will move the head and also when I am making this two as the left child of this I will also put that into the queue so that we can uh, after this uh, work of one I will put the uh, left and right child of the two as well okay after this I will put the three as the right child of this part also I will put that three into the three node into the queue part now what will happen as I have put in the left and right child towards this now I will take this two out and from this two now the head is over here I will continuously move head at every step okay now at this head part I will make this make this four as a tree node and I will make this as a left child of two and also I will put this as five of child okay when the head now our head is at head is at at null now we will at this point we will stop and our tree is made we will return this root node okay so this is kind of approach let's understand in the code as well okay firstly what i will do is i will check for the null part if head equals to equals to null if head equals to null means there is no node in the link list so what we have to return we have to also return the null part okay so uh, let me just increase the font size okay. so this is how we are uh, handling the base case okay that is kind of edge case or maybe base case you can tell Okay, now what we have to do, now I will create the node, root node. Okay, this is tree, tree node. I will create the root node equals to new tree. Okay, now I will have to take the data, head dot data. Now what I will do is, as I have created, as I have used the data of the first node, now I will increase the, I will, I will move the head to the next node, head equals to head dot next. Now what I will do is, I will make a queue for this part, queue of type tree node. Now I make a queue of type tree node and I will name this as QUE equals to new. I am making this as type of linked list. I am making this queue as type of linked list. Okay. So this is how I have made. Now I will push this root node Q dot add. Okay. Now I will move this to, I will put the node part to the queue. But before this, I will make a reference of this part. So tree current, okay, equals to node. I'm making this reference so that when I'm returning this part, so this will not change. So that's why I'm making this as a reference. Okay, current node as a reference. So we have created this reference. Now I have to create, 
I am making a while loop while head not equals to null. While head not not equals to null, what we have to do is firstly I will find out the I will take the current node. Okay, so I will take the current node from this part q dot pole. So I will take the current node like this q dot pole. And now what I have to do is I will push I will make a tree node right tree left node because we have to fill from left to right. Okay. Tree left equals to new tree and I, have, I will put head dot data. Okay. As I have used the head dot data, now I will move the head to head dot next. Head dot next. And also, as I have made the left part, now I will attach this current with current dot left equals to left node. Okay. So this is how I am making this as left node. Now what I have to do is, I will also check at this part that if head not equals to null, I will make the right part as well. I will make the right as well. Now what I have to do is also we have forgotten one step that we have to push the q dot at. We have to push the left child for the in the queue as well. Okay. Now what we have to do is I am creating the right child tree dot tree right equals to new tree head dot data. Now we have to perform the same steps. Okay, now current dot right. We have to put current dot right as right. Now what we have to do? As we have used the data of head, now I will move the head to the next pointer. Now I will also add this to Q. Q dot add right. Okay, so this is how I am doing this code. Now what we will do? We will return the node, the root node. This is the root node. We are returning the root node. So this is how we are doing this. Question. Let's try to firstly run this and if it is correct, then we will also submit it. Okay. I think there is some error cannot find symbol Q U E. Okay. So we have to put the tree only over here. It is not tree node. It is just a tree. Okay. So now it is giving us correct answer. Let's try to submit it. So the question is submitted. I hope you like the video. If you find the video suitable for you, you can subscribe the channel. Thank you.